Chef Diane DeMeo and welcome to Bootleg Tips. Today I am making an avocado smash. What is an avocado smash? Well, it's a little spicy horseradish avocado that's smashed up with a little bit of garlic and lime juice. And be sure to check out my Yes Veggie Burger with an avocado smash because that's what I'm going to use it on. But you can use it on anything that you want because trust me, it goes good with just about everything. What do I need to make an avocado smash? We got an avocado, we got some horseradish grated, you can use fresh if you wanted to, garlic, some lime for lime juice, and a little bit of salt. All right, let's get making the avocado smash. First things first, get the avocado ready to go, and get it into my bowl. I like my avocado smash, very horseradishy, so I'm gonna use a lot. But you don't have to use a lot. You can use whatever you want. But for me, for one avocado, I'm going in with about, oh, one tablespoon. There it is. I'm gonna have about half of a lime of lime juice. I use the grater for garlic because it kind of gives it a nice, fresh, garlicky, juicy, juice, yum, yum. You have the garlic press, you can use that too, but we're gonna do it this way. Not three quarters of a garlic clove. Add some salt. We're going in at about half a teaspoon. And you guessed it, mash. I use a lime not just because to give it flavor, but also because when an avocado gets into the air, it oxidizes and it turns brown. So it keeps the avocado having a nice, vibrant, fresh green color. I'm not gonna mash it up too much because I like it chunky when I eat my veggie burger or when I like it on everything else. I just wanna make sure that I incorporate a lot of the flavors into it. And that's it. And here is the avocado smash with what? Horseradish, lime juice, some garlic, and salt. And we have a little bite to taste. Mm. Mm -hmm. and this is gonna go excellent on everything that you make, and I will see you next week with another bootleg tip. Hello, I am Chef Diane DeMeo, and welcome to my kitchen. I am making a veggie burger. Yes, why? Well, because sometimes we just want a veggie burger, and it's okay to have one, even though sometimes I might be stuffing some pork inside mine. But today, no meat just vegetables.